dear friends uh, today i will tell you how to simulate regulated power supply to regulate plus 12 or minus 12 volt or plus 5 or minus 5 volt so to do that launch this software go to this uh, it professional create a project so i'll give some name let us say xp uh, and say next Say next and uh, I'll try to do uh, project to place the component and uh, to make a connection according to your circuit diagram. Click on this component mode uh, open black symbol. Go here and pick the devices. What you need? You need bridge rectifier. So select this bridge rectifier. Again, click on the P to pick the device. Say you want a transformer, let us say center tap the transformer and pick the device which is having two primary side and three that is center tap transformer. Then you need ICs 7, 8, 1, 2. So select these ICs. You need another IC 2, 4, or minus full load regulating that is 7, 9, 1, 2 select that then again you type uh, you need what let us say sign AC voltage select this if you double click on this it will, it will be selected so you need capacitor that is polarized capacitor so double click on this you will get it here then you need a capacitor so double click you will get this and uh, you you need capacitor you know capacitor is selected okay now you need ground go to this terminal mode and select one ground keep the ground here then place your components so let us say bridge rectifier then uh, Say so there in your transformer. Then to the input of the transformer is AC sine wave. Place that component. Place your capacitor. Then place your uh, IC is seven eight one two. It is a plus twelve volt regulator. Then seven nine one two is a minus twelve volt regulator. So flip this, make a mirror so that it is easy to for a connection. Then uh, output side, select capacitor. Okay, we need a normal capacitor here. Okay, then go to pick devices select this generic non electrolyte capacitor for the output put side of the ICs so rotate them you can rotate it by clicking on the capacitor and uh, right click on the mouse and uh, click on rotate clockwise now make a connection so secondary of the transformer and connecting to the bridge rectifier then output of the bridge rectifier is given to the regulators so make the connection according to the circuit diagram then So this should be connected to ground so let us connect so one thing you have, you have to observe that the pin numbers for 7812 7812 is different and pin number for 7912 is different here pin number 1 is input but here pin number 1 is ground 
So be careful while connecting. And center tab should be connected to ground. Then on the primary of the transform, give the input from this V sine K. So change the capacitor. So make it red. It is a point one. Double click on that value to change the value and enter appropriate value. So to give the input, you have to give amplitude and frequency. Double click on this. So here don't change these things. Uh, these are the naming conventions. So change only two things. Amplitude I will give let us say 20 volt and frequency let us say 100 hertz. So to observe the output, go to virtual instrument mode, then select DC voltmeter. So one for this, another one for <coughs> measuring the negative voltage. So flip this and make a connection if everything is correct then should get the output so to simulate it click on this so as you can see uh, it is giving proper plus to load and uh, 7912 is giving proper minus to load if you want to regulate plus 5 or minus 5 volt then you just need to change this I see select 7805 to regulate plus 5 volt and to regulate minus 5 volt select 7912 from this component picking like 7805 you'll get these devices 797805 for plus 5 volt regulation 7905 for minus 5 volt regulation so hope this helps for conducting experiment Thank